Coon Cassis IFL team in association with MTK Global. I'm with James Decal, <laughs> IFF world champion. You're in a better mood today? Much better mood. Hey, that media day drove me mad, obviously making weight. Uh, just something like a parrot repeating myself constantly. And then Richard Maynard lined me up and there was uh, papers there. And I was literally saying, question eight, but I just repeat myself. And it was just in the end, I'm like, fuck. And by the time I got to you, I was like, talked out, I was like, oh, I just wanted to go home, eat and go sleep. So for future reference, are you telling me to get in first? Get me first, grab me first. You're the main, you're the main, you're the main guy anyway, Coop. So you should be first. Um, yeah, press conference day today, a couple of days away uh, before you're out in action at the yeah. Copper Box. So how are you feeling here this Saturday, first of all? I'm feeling good, you know. I'm feeling real good, doing my weight great, like last time. Uh, had a great training, uh, my injury free, right? I'm parrot again here, I'm repeating myself all day. But no, yeah, no, I'm feeling real good, man. My shoulders are all nice, I'm in good shape, I feel fit. It's actually surprised me really because since my operation, it's like it's been a long road. And the first couple of months was difficult like, with rehab and very frustrated we were all. The first couple of weeks I couldn't move it at all. Every time I took out and sleep, it was like, oh. So I've come a long way and I'm just very happy. You're not going to see a wicked performance with two arms now. I can jab. You're going to see me jab. It's crazy in the Showtime box that I uh, threw seven jabs in the whole fight. That's madness. Seven jabs. It's crazy. One arm. I literally blocked one arm. Let's take you away from the fight week. Just yeah. to mix it up. Mix up, yeah, yeah, I like this. Mix mix up. Up. Have you been watching Amir Khan in the jungle? Amir Khan. He's funny. I love Amir Khan. He, so when he first went, I went, are you sure he wants to do this? Some of the things he said, yeah, he's bantering. I'm not I'm like, are people aren't like that. But no, he's all right. I, I, I've enjoyed it. Him, the screams he does. <laughs> Over a spider, you know? A spider. He's scared of spiders and snakes. Nah, man, don't do snakes. <laughs> yeah, nah, don't do snakes. <laughs> 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 I don't do spiders, man. He's but he funny. has been relatively yeah. entertaining in there. He's been he? joking. Very, I've yeah. It, yeah. But I don't he's think he joking. means to be well, funny. I think he's been naturally what about, funny. What about when he half played yeah. like about Ian? I know. <laughs> the strawberry. And everyone strawberry was with him. Yeah. Nah, but I mean, he's done well, man. And hopefully he can win. You never know. It's done well, but it's done good for his uh, profile. Yeah, is it something you'd consider something like that? After your boxing career? No, they've half on me to do that strictly, but I'm, I'm not. Listen, I'm in. I'm in the boxing game. I don't really. I'm not. Believe it or not, it's hard to believe because I'm very much out there and you know what I mean? the fame bit. I don't really like. I just love earning money and and winning belts and being known for what I'm good at and people give me appreciate respect. it. Yeah, for, appreciate, for what yeah. you do in the ring. Yeah, that's all that's important. I'm not really to you. on like obviously the fame and people knowing you. It comes with. It comes with it from from being successful and doing well. You are, but yeah, I'm not really on that. But you, oh yeah, maybe down the line. You've had kind of this since you won the gold, mm. haven't you? Since yeah. then, and it's been like I said, through your pro mm. career, obviously winning the world title. So it has been kind of yeah. from day one, if you like. From day one, yeah. And I've uh, done. Do you remember when I done beat the star? I don't think you remember me doing that. No. When I first uh, turned pro. I've done loads of stuff. I've done Gladiator, that was terrible. I lost him, there's like a celebrity Gladiator. And I was against Kieran Bracken, the rugby player. And I was terrible on that, I was fat, overweight, and I went on that. I've done loads of stuff when I first come back because it was all new. I was like, ah, oh, wow, well, yeah, definitely. But now I'm just like, oh, no. You must be getting sick to death if people keep mentioning the same kind of super mm, middleweight to you. Especially this week. <laughs> yeah, this week. <laughs> Some people like pumping Groves' yeah. name, and we done. We spoke about yeah. Groves the other day at the workout. Groves, honestly, yeah. let's go through that again. It's probably going to be on uh, Box Nation. Could be done. Yeah, yeah. How does he justify that he's number one? Seriously, in the world, like it's mad. He beat Murray, good fight, but come on, Murray and Brophy, and then box Chidinoff for his world title. Mate, is he mad? Is he weird? And the head is fucked up in the head. Who did I box? Look at my last five opponents. But I can't even, I don't even speak to these people anymore. And he can't fool people. People know who he's box. Like, he can't try and persuade people that she's going some monster. Sorry, you bang ain't box no who one. Who aggravates you more out of the two of them? I'm not saying they either of them do. That's a hard but one. You know? <laughs> Bro, it's hard. It's hard. Uh, oh, that's hard. That's really hard. I can't even tell you. There's 
both annoying idiots. And you know what? They probably think I'm a donut. They probably think I'm an idiot. Like them, but I just think it just kills them, though. Do you know what I've done and what I've achieved and what I'm doing and who I'm with and what I'm getting and what I'm earning? It kills them. But, I mean, I remember, I think after Eubank beat Quillen, they did that, him and his dad did that video kind of calling you out. Uh, oh, yeah, Quillen, yeah. after he beat Quillen. Yeah, you, but Eubank Senior is an idiot. He's just like, he's looking, the guy was a rubbish fighter, he was shit, really. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling you the truth. Bit harsh. He was rubbish, he was shit, really. He wasn't that good. I'm telling you the truth. A proper fight is nice. It's true, though, it's Nigel Ben. Go and look at his record. Went to America. Look at his record. McLennan. Doug DeWitt, Barkley, he smashed it, that's a proper champion, you hear me, lost, come back, done his thing, boxed everyone, who did Eubank fight? Oh. No, who did he fight? Who did he fight? Best name his record, win. You can't even give it to me. Do you want me to I'm tell you, not, Nigel uh, Ben, not, domestic, okay. what, that's it, no, I'm going to go in a bit more. Who else did he fight? Do you know what, he was a, he was a, he was a showman. Fighting wise, he was tough and he was a showman, that's all. Go on. And Eubank Jr., Eubank Jr., the guy's a donut. Now, that is a donut because he's boxing one. He's, it's true, that's one thing I agree with with George Groves, yeah, is that he's insta famous. Goes on the pads and oh, look at that. Takes off his top, got the man eight pack. Wow. Donut, donut. 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 There's box, no one. Donut. James, there's something about that fight, even alongside the Groves fight, you and Eubank is a massive, massive fight. Bro, agree? I, I agree with you. I agree with you, but let them fight out to box the champ, the real champ. It's true, let them fight out and we can get on next year. Simple as. What is the plan for you for next year, ideally? To map me out your plan okay, if you could pick it. Perfect year. And yeah. this is what's going to happen. I'm going to box Benavides for the WBC and the unification fight after I get through Turex. And then, I'm not too sure if I can fit in another fight and then I want the winner of the Super Series. If not, if, 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 if they're messing around and all these negotiations and money and I want more, I'll go and box someone else. Ramirez, someone else, I don't know. I don't know what I'll do, but the next stop in 2018 is Benavides. Is there a possibility you could move up a weight or not? Possibility, yeah. 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 There's a whole new world there for you. It is. A difficult one, but the right fire. The right fight, yeah. There's some very good light of the way to very the moment. Very good. There's certain ones I'd have to swerve, but... <laughs> <laughs> certain ones I would swerve, but... Bivol? He looks good. He looks good. Looks but good, then eh? Russians are, do you know what I'm yeah. saying? Who's the box? The way you not, but the way you not, him out. mad. Trent um, too. Yeah. Kovalev's good. I wouldn't mind Stevenson, believe it or not. Can bang, can punch. He went to the same uh, Commonwealth Games as me. And he lost in the final to Fletcher. Fletcher beat me and him in the final. So, yeah. Do you think you've got more than two years in the game? The way I'm feeling now, I've got more. I can, I can go on as long as I want. The way I'm feeling mentally, physically, all healed up now. And once again, I'm going to sound like a parrot again. But you, know, like, you don't know how much this shoulder was really doing my head and was really affecting me mentally as well. Do you know what I'm saying? I'm going in the uh, gym to train and I'm sparring with people they're really just sparring partners and I was giving me good spars they're giving me good spars mentally I was like oh. but yeah. how stable do you feel in your the other side of your boxing kind of you know your promotional management that side of things oh, broadcast wicked, side wicked, wicked. Yeah. Well, I'm in a I'm in a perfect position now. I'm a free agent I work with who I want uh, I've got Al Heyman behind me he's the main man most powerful man in boxing Got all, he's got all the links, pays me extremely well, gets me the best deals. I'm in a fantastic position. Well, I mean, ideally for Frank Warren, he'd want you to kind of, of course, you know, Frank, have your pay. future on BT Frank and Box pay. Nation. I told him, there's no secret. I go where I'm going to get promoted the best and get paid the best. If Frank's going to put his hand in his pocket and pay me like he did this time round. Yeah. At the end, like. I actually spoke to her in my text uh, yesterday. We had a little, had a little back full flight. No good. Like me and Eddie are cool, but it's like he's probably a bit angry that uh, I'm not boxing this guy. Is that the indication you get from him? That yeah, one hundred percent he's screwing. Yeah. But 
and I said to him, you had your chance. I actually said to him, I had your, like, you had your chance. We had to do his aunt's daddy for some more money. That's what we had to do. I did. I, I said it. I'm going to show you the text. I said that to him. We had to do his aunt's cut for more money, bro, and we could have done this. Yeah? And then he said, uh, oh, well, well, well. He said, it's good, like, you're looking good. And then, uh, oh, and he said about, no, I'm not even going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you, but yeah. Okay. Uh, you never know, man. Oh, wait, come on. In the end, it's cool. Same people, they're cool. What's the main objective for you this Saturday? To, to look good winning and or just no, getting the win? No, no, no. I've got to go in there and uh, knock out tracks. I've got to, like, people been calling for a, for a dominant performance. Uh, I've got to go in there and look good. Look, if I just go in there and it's lacklustre again, and I just get through it and win. It's not on. Not so we'll go in there and, and do the business. Okay. Yeah. Have you got anything else you'd like to add, James? No, apart from take a look on my Twitter and Instagram, whatever. People are looking forward to it, but this will be a sellout on Saturday. I'm pretty sure it will. There's only a couple of falls and fifties left. Everything else is gone. Uh, Frank put on a good show, a wicked show. There's a lot of talent on there. And now I'm looking forward to it, man. Just keep on supporting. I appreciate it. The gold's back, in it? Behold the gold. You're going to watch them unfold. Quick question, <laughs> just to end on. Uh, away from anything to do with you. Have you been keeping an eye on the, the ever-happening heavyweight scene? Yeah. Yeah. Still, we're obviously back in Gypsy, training. Gypsy Warrior. When's he back, man? Got, Gypsy Warrior. He's got his hip call. <laughs> he's got a hearing yeah. uh, next week. So. I'm looking forward to seeing him back. I think... Uh, AJ knocks out Parker, easy fight, but he gets another belt. I think Wilder and Joshua is a fantastic, intriguing fight. Two big punches, but I'm looking forward to Gypsy Warrior, Gypsy King. Gypsy King. <laughs> yeah. All right, James DeGale, thank you very yeah, much for talking no, to ITL TV. Good, yeah. And uh, listen, we'll catch up with you Appreciate after your fight bro. on Saturday, all right? Yeah, bro. All right, cheers, mate.